distinguished guests, speakers, participants, ladies and gentlemen. A very good day to each and every one of you from the Pearl of the Orient, Penang Island. I am Rohaiza, and on behalf of the host, welcome to Alcon 2021. This is the 10th International English Language Teaching Conference that is being organized and hosted by Delta. This year's theme is Developing Future Skills in English Language Teaching. It is unfortunate that we are not able to personally welcome you to our beautiful island, but we are very proud to bring Alcon 2021 to you virtually. It is therefore befitting that one of the themes of our conference revolves around leveraging technology in education to drive creativity and innovation in a world experiencing unprecedented disruption. Without further ado, let us start with a welcoming speech by our beloved Madam President, Ms. Rovina Capel. Yang amat berhormat Tuan Chao Konyao, the Chief Minister of Penang, Dr. Gabriela Klekova from the University of West Bohemia, Czech Republic, who is also the TESOL International Association USA President for the term 2021 to 2022, Associate Professor Dr. Jonathan Newton from Victoria University of Wellington, New Zealand. Associate Professor Dr. Tomas Kish from Sunway University, Malaysia. Mr. Alan Davenport, the Teacher Development Manager for the Southeast Asian Region at Cambridge University Press. Our distinguished featured and invited speakers, fellow Peltarians, ladies and gentlemen, good morning everyone. On behalf of PELTA, I warmly welcome all to IELTSCON 2021, our 10th International English Language Teaching Conference. We especially thank Yang Amat Bohormat Tuan Chao Konyao for making time in his very busy schedule to grace the opening ceremony of our conference. We hope that the Penang State Government will continue to give PELTA its support in all our future activities. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very pleased to announce that at this conference, we have presenters and participants from at least 26 countries, namely Australia, Bangladesh, Bhutan, Canada, China, the Czech Republic, Hungary, India, Indonesia, Iran, Japan, Kuwait, Mexico, the Netherlands, New Zealand, Pakistan, Peru, the Philippines, Thailand, Saudi Arabia, Singapore, Sri Lanka, the United Kingdom, the United States, Venezuela, and Malaysia. Welcome, everyone. We also welcome and thank all our keynote speakers for accepting our invitation to speak at this conference. Dr. Gabriela Krakova. Welcome, Gabriela. We're very pleased to have you join us at this conference and we hope to work with you again in future activities. Associate Professor Dr. Jonathan Newton. Jonathan is a loved and loyal supporter of PELTA. Thank you, Jonathan. We are very happy to have you join us again. Associate Professor Dr. Tomas Kish. Tom Tomas is no newcomer to PELTA. He is one of our most loved and loyal supporters. Thank you, Tomas. We are always happy to have you with us. Mr. Alan Davenport. Alan is also a very loyal and loved supporter of PELTA. Thank you, Alan. It is always a pleasure having you with us. We also welcome our featured and invited speakers, Ms. Lucille Das, who is our beloved and passionate founder member of PELTA, who also wrote the acronym for PELTA, which you will find in the program book. Mr. Mike Mayer from Pearson, Dr. Francesca Maria Yvonne from Universitas Negeri Malang, Indonesia. Mr. Amin Negawati from the United World College of Southeast Asia, Singapore. Mr. Dera Estuarso from SMP Negeri Lima Ngawan, Indonesia, who is also the Jogja English, who is also with the Jogja English Teachers Association. Mr. Samuel Isaiah, who is the Director of Pemimpin GSL, Malaysia. Ms. Miriam Esther Puente Rodriguez, 
from Primaria Vespertina Leona Vicario, Mexico. We also warmly welcome our Thailand TESOL affiliate representatives, Associate Professor Dr. Korn Wipa Punpon, Chair of the Regional Affiliates, Khan Khan University, Thailand, and Dr. Wacharin Fongoi, Chair of the Lower Southern Affiliate Princess of Naradivas University, Thailand. Sawadika and welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, IELTSCon 2021 is part of PELTA's commitment to develop and enhance innovative and successful teaching and learning practices among the ELT community. Many changes have taken place in the world of teaching over the past two years, and this is especially so in the role that our association has had to play in providing support to our members. PELTA realised that we need to help our members in ways we, have never, we had never done before to stay relevant and to maintain connectivity with them throughout this pandemic. We had to learn new ways to connect virtually in order to reach out in support of teachers caught in the drastic educational changes that came with the global crisis. PELTA moved towards developing online monthly workshops and webinars through working with teachers, professional organizations and experts from across the globe to provide specialized development to support members in this new digital online learning loop. This pandemic has been a learning curve for PELTA. We have had to adapt quickly to the changes and challenges faced by everyone. It was rather intimidating initially, initially but I'm happy to say that we have grown through this crisis. This pandemic has most certainly opened new doors for PELTA. There's no question that English language educators from all levels are capable of incredible things. They have truly risen to the occasion during this calamity. The main aim of this conference is to address and support the changing needs of English language educators today and to focus on developing future skills, hence our theme. PELTA acknowledges and is thankful to the various sponsors and all those who have contributed in one way or another towards the success of this conference. To all presenters and participants, I congratulate and thank you. Your participation shows your level of professional commitment to a worldwide ELT community. I wish all an enlightening and enjoyable conference. Thank you. Thank you, Rovina. Ladies and gentlemen, we are very honoured today to have the Chief Minister of Penang, Yang Amat Berhormat, Tuan Chao Kon Yao, to graciously officiate the opening of Alcon 2021. Presidents of Pauta, organising committee members, teachers and educators from Malaysia, and international participants of the 10th International English Language Teaching Conference 2021, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning to all of you. It is my pleasure to be here today among a community of English language experts, teachers, language practitioners, lecturers from various educational institutions throughout Malaysia as well as from abroad. A very warm welcome to all. I understand that this is the 10th International Conference organized by the Penang English Language Learning and Teaching Association, PELTA, but the first to be conducted by virtual conference. I believe that PELTA will do your best and the conference will provide participants with a good balance of both research and the best pedagogical practices through the rich varieties of presentation during this conference. The state government definitely applauds and supports the good intentions of PELTA to develop and enhance the capacity of our English language teachers by nurturing the present and future generations of students to be effective global citizens who will have an impact on our economy 
as well as the development of Penang and our country. To presenters and participants from abroad, I wish your countries will greatly benefit when you bring home what you have gained from this conference. Ladies and gentlemen, you have the privilege and the challenge of teaching English language to diverse learners at varying levels of competency in the language. More importantly, all of you play a key role in ensuring that your students are able to use English to communicate effectively. Therefore, I am very confident that this two-day international conference will serve as a platform for the exchange of information, ideas and experiences based on research, pedagogy and best practices of the presenters and keynote speakers from across the globe. I also believe that this conference will provide the opportunity for English language educators to form professional learning networks to support one another. The conference has adopted a timely team that is developing future skills in English language teaching. We need to ask ourselves what are the appropriate measures we can take to help our learners develop language competency academically now and professionally at a later stage in life. The English language is the world's lingua franca. It is the language medium that provides access to international relations, global investments, and job markets. Hence, it is of vital importance not only to address its decline, but also to enhance the English language proficiency amongst our students in this modern, technologically driven world. Let us together produce future ready students and graduates who are competent in the English language to meet the demands of the industry in Penang. I would also like to commend the presenters and participants for taking the opportunity afforded by this conference to come together to share your views, ideas and research findings. Despite the challenges of the pandemic, I am glad you have decided to come together for professional growth. I wish all a fruitful conference. With this, I declare the 10th International English Language Teaching Conference 2021 officially open. Thank you very much. Thank you, Yang Aman Berhormat. Ladies and gentlemen, that's the end of our opening ceremony. We look forward to two days of exceptional sharing and learning, and we at PELTA are at your service to ensure a successful conference. Our first keynote address, Zen and the Art of English Language Teaching by Associate Professor Dr. Tamash Keys from Sunway University is scheduled at 9.30 a.m. Malaysian time. Thank you and salam sejahtera. Happy conferencing. <laughs>